Oyster catchers can be easily defined by their red and orange bills, their black and white plumage and their loud piping noise. They are wading birds which will usually be found along the coast of the UK but have recently started breeding inland. When in flight they have strong, shallow beats and will circle unwanted visitors who are near their territory. Males and females are similar in appearance with the main slight noticeable difference being the male's shorter, thicker bills. You will often see these birds gather together, which is called a parcel of oyster catchers. They have a particular entertaining method of courtship and solving hierarchical problems, which you will probably hear before you see. They will gather in groups and have their heads down to the floor, create trill noises and run around. Oyster catchers start breeding from the age of 4 to 5 and will lay one clutch of eggs per year. They are ground nesting birds and prefer to lay their eggs either in the sand or in rocky areas on the beach. The eggs are cream with speckles and very well camouflaged amongst stones and shells. The male and female share the responsibility of the incubation of the eggs. This lasts for 24 to 27 days. Despite the name, oyster catchers rarely eat oysters. Instead, they eat other shellfish, insects, worms and crabs. They can use their long beak to either smash or prise apart shells and use them like tweezers to catch insects and worms in the sand and seaweed. Oyster catchers enjoy hunting on cockle beds, however, these are usually exploited for human consumption, which then threatens the oyster catcher population. Despite this, the oyster catcher population is thriving in the UK and will hopefully continue to do so.